exhaust air heat recovery is a way to recover and utilize the heat of indoor air leaving a building. A heat pump system is needed to utilize the heat. It is usually connected parallel to a geo energy or a district heating system. From the heat pump, the cool heat transfer fluid will travel to the roof mounted heat recovery unit. The fluid travels in an insulated line that has been installed on the building's facade or stairway. The warm indoor air will travel through the heat recovery unit's heat exchanger. This transfers heat from the air to the heat transfer fluid. The air cools down and exits the building, and the warm fluid returns to the heat pump. An efficient process occurs in the heat pump. The heat recovered by the heat transfer fluid will transfer to the building's heating water and warm household water. The process generates three or four times the heat energy in comparison to the electricity used. From the heat pump, the water used for heating the building travels to the buffer tank. Warm water is constantly cycled to the radiator network from the buffer tank. If necessary, district heating can be used for more heat if the heat recovery system has been connected parallel to district heating. The warm water travels to the apartments and warms the indoor air through the hot water radiators. When the water cools down, it returns to the heat pump. The hot water tank is connected to the cold water supply. The supplied cold water will warm up when it comes into contact with the hot water heated by the heat pump in the tank's heat exchanger. District heating will be used to heat the household water further if necessary. The warm water is supplied to the residents. The heat pump provides the tank with heating water when necessary and cool water that has transferred its heat returns to the heat pump. The hot water tank size is based on the number of apartments and the demand for warm household water.